My name is Ricardo Bernal. I'm an associate professor uh, here in the Department of, of Chemistry and I teach uh, biochemistry. So our lab focuses on protein folding and the activity of some enzymes that are called chaperonins. These chaperonins are enzymes that help other proteins fold. If it cannot fold properly, then it won't be active. And so these chaperonins help the other proteins fold properly. Uh, but we're, we're looking at currently two mutations. These mutations, they occur in a single amino acid. If you change one of them, it causes a disease. One of these diseases is called hereditary spastic paraplegia and it causes muscle stiffness um, to where people usually will end up in a wheelchair. So it's, it's a progressive disease. And so we're looking at how it is that just a single amino acid mutation or change results in these diseases. The type of skills that students would be learning would be protein uh, expression in bacteria, protein purification. So we do a lot of protein purification. It's not an easy technique. It's challenging, but that means it's also a lot of fun. And then a lot of analytical techniques to determine whether our proteins are actually pure or not, and also functional assays to make sure that the proteins that we're working with are actually active. They're going to be probably learning how to use um, the ACTA, which is a computer-controlled uh, chromatography system for the purification of, of a lot of these proteins, and various other small instruments also that um, we use for the purification of proteins or to analyze them. It's a good opportunity to determine whether perhaps a career in research is for them or whether maybe they, they might not like it. Uh, most students do, however. Um, and so it's a good opportunity to get exposed to, to research.